Today we're diving into a sticky showdown with different types of super glue for 3D printing. We're going to perform our snap test and our twist test on some of the most popular super glues out there to see which one performs the best. <laughs> So I've received a lot of requests to test various different types of super glues over the last year since I started doing glue tests. And it's been everything from Loctite to Starbond to even some of the ones that actually have a uh, spray accelerator. But today's super glues we're tested are Loctite, Gorilla Glue, Starbond, DAP, which you get at like your local store such as Lowe's, as well as the original super glue. So if you haven't seen my test previously, Basically, what we do is we do a snap test, which I bond these two pieces together and then see if I could snap them and if it breaks the PLA or it breaks the bond. And we also do a twist test to see if we could twist the two pieces apart. Now, why are we using those two tests? Well, it's designed to simulate things like building this cosplay hammer where you may be holding it in your hands or using it as a cosplay item and if it will hold up. So let's get all these bonded together and see how they hold up in the snap and the twist test. Okay, let's give these some time to set. All right, safety first. Always wear safety goggles when you're breaking stuff. We're going to start with the DAP super glue. This is the break test. Okay, the PLA didn't break, so the glue actually failed here on the break test. Let's try the twist test. Okay, pass the twist test. Next, let's try the original super glue. We're gonna do the break test. Oh. Okay, I'm starting to wonder if it may be a little too humid here and we may have to start this test over again. That broke way too easy. Let's try the twist test. And it failed on the twist test too. Let's try the Gorilla Glue. Okay, the PLA broke. So this one passed the snap test. Let's try the twist test. Next, let's try the star bond. Okay, PLA broke. Let's try the twist test. All we have left is the Loctite. Okay, PLA broke. Let's try the twist test. Okay. Passed. It is, it's been raining, so it has been a little humid. So I am going to retry this original super glue. I mean, it was really loose though. It does seem still a little tacky. And I'm gonna re-glue this one and see what happens. Let's let them take some time to cure. We redid the DAP and the original super glue, and let's see if they hold. Like I said, it is pretty humid. Yeah, yeah, it didn't. Nothing, nothing. Let's try the original super glue. Once again, nothing. I don't know if they're just not good for PLA, but they both failed. I mean, the original super glue even failed the twist test where at least the DAP passed the twist test. So the three that passed our test were the Loctite, the Gorilla Glue, and the Star Bond. All of them did a great job breaking at the PLA level and holding when we did the snap test and all of them passed the twist test. And I think what we're gonna do is we're gonna perform another test with these super glues using our force meter. So make sure you like and subscribe, that way you can see this video. Also, I do plan on testing Kraken and this Instant Bond, which actually both feature accelerants. So guys, make sure you like and follow for other glue tests. 
For more on 3D printing, DIY, and maker projects, make sure you like and follow Maker Build It. And remember, keep on making.